if you always support the correct principles then you will never get the wrong results. When I die, I desire no better winding sheet than the stars and stripes, and no softer pillow than the constitution of my country. Washington, D.C. is 12 square miles bordered by reality. The life of a republic lies certainly in the energy, virtue, and intelligence of its citizens. The goal to strive for is a poor government but a rich people. Honest conviction is my courage. The Constitution is my guide. Let them impeach and be damned. It is a damn poor mind indeed which can't think of at least two ways to spell any word. If I am to be shot at, I want no man to be in the way of the bullet. Duties have been mine, consequences are God's. I feel incompetent to perform duties, which have been so unexpectedly thrown upon me. Legislation can neither be wise nor just which seeks the welfare of a single interest at the expense, and to the injury of many and varied interests. Slavery exists. It is black in the South, and white in the North. It is our sacred duty to transmit unimpaired to our posterity the blessings of liberty, which were bequeathed to us by the founders of the Republic. Whenever you hear a man prating about the Constitution, spot him as a traitor. I realized. There are people out there who can beat me, want to beat me. And unless I continue to innovate and evolve, I am going to learn a painful lesson from someone who has. My right side is paralyzed. I need no doctor. I can overcome my own troubles. If the rabble were locked off at one end and the aristocrat at the other, all would be well with the country.